Okay, how you doing out there, uh, YouTubers, friends, and subscribers? What I've got here in my hand, I've had for a couple of weeks. It's a new uh, uh, controller chip for my Solar Stalker uh, Dual Axis High Wind Parking uh, Solar Tracker controller. And apparently, all I got to do is go outside and take the old one out and put this one in without bending the little pins. And this is supposed to be uh, updated and easier to go through the menus on. And it's not raining today, so I'm going to try to get this done, and we'll see. So there'll be more to come on this. Haven't been in a big hurry to put it in because it's working absolutely fine. But uh, Dave from Laser Precision Craft did send me this, and I told him I would put it in and try it. So just doing a little update. I just haven't got around to it. So anyway, there'll be more to come on this. That's it for now. I'll be back with more. Okay, how you doing there, YouTube friends and subscribers? I'm going to try to capture, out here in the uh, cold and the mud, the installation of the controller chip. So, here we go. Hopefully I'm catching this. Okay, now I guess I gotta come in here and take this off. Luckily, I brought numerous screwdrivers. This is the first time I've been in here. I had no reason to do anything with it. It's more tools I guess there's no way I can put my hands in here all right I'll be back shut this off for now I gotta figure this out okay hopefully this is in focus after four attempts I think I got it kind of holding on to it with this this is the new 2020 chip Seems fairly well seated. All right, I'm gonna put the screws back in and turn it back on. <clears throat> Hardest part was getting the old one out. I'll be back. Okay, I got the new chip in. The uh, tracker's doing it thing. It's doing its thing. It's back in dual axis mode. I don't know if I have to go reset everything. I don't know. Thank you. 